Hey guys, what's going on? Absolutely Beast here. Bring you guys a video on Forza Motorsport 6 on Road Atlanta. So, uh, this is one of my favorite tracks. Uh, it was a, one of my top couple favorites. On, does that make sense? Couple favorites? I don't know. Who knows? I'm rolling with it. On Forza 5. And uh, it doesn't come up too often on Forza 6. So, um, every time I get it, I, I do enjoy it. So, um, at this point, I'm in 5th. Uh, it looks like there's 14 people, so this was a lap, um, I had made a new tune, uh, the tune that I've been using all this time since, uh, February is an all-around tune, so, um, because these tracks are laser mapped and GPS mapped, uh, they're incredibly realistic, I mean, it's a driving simulator, so they're going to be anyway, but, I mean, everything from these little undulations in the track, like, watch the different gradient changes here in this corner, I mean, you go up slightly here, and then it flattens out, and then you go down a little bit, and then it kind of goes back up. And I mean, even every little change in the track is, I mean, is unique to that track, obviously, because it's, it's like a real world, you know, road, it's a real world track. So, uh, in theory, you would want to have a tune specifically for every single track, and then even arguably every variation of every track, which is like near a hundred variations, which means you'd have to have near a hundred tunes, which is almost impossible. I mean, that would take you six months if you dedicated your time to it. So. Uh, the great thing about tuning, though, and one of the hidden gems is when you spend enough time with a car and you spend enough time fine-tuning it up to your own liking, what you find is that it inevitably works on another track uh, that you were not intending it to work on. Although some, once you get to know that, you know, you can kind of cross-tune a little bit, but um, it was something that I found out in Forza 5 through tuning. I had lots and lots of time tuning in that game. And, uh, you know, you'd find that, like, oh, man, this tune works really well on this track, which is, you know always kind of a cool thing to discover. So this was exactly that situation. So um, this is a spa tune that I'm running right now. And uh, Road Atlanta, honestly, really has almost no similarities to spa, um, except that it's kind of a fast track. Uh, and there's really, a, there's no explanation for why it would work here, but uh, that's what I was using. And uh, I actually set a new time recently, within the past uh, couple weeks, I guess, uh, of a 116.4. And I didn't know that when I was in the race. So I didn't know how fast I was going. And when I got this fourth lap here, um, I had been running like 17.0s, so when I when I come across the finish line here on this lap and it's a 16.6, I was like, oh, dude, and I was freaking out. I thought, man, that has to be a new fastest, and uh, I thought for sure I was flying and that I was going pretty fast, and then I ended up getting an even faster lap uh, on the last one, so uh, now this was the clean lap. Uh, the last lap is not clean, so obviously it doesn't count, um, and this actually wasn't a new fastest for me. Unfortunately, uh, my fastest is a, is a 116.4, which ranks me about 225 in the Americas, which, you know, is not that good, to be honest. Um, so, there's a lot of work for me to do, but the, the lap that I run right here, it, it's not, it's not dirty, like, I, I mean, I don't, well, it's probably dirty because of that right there, honestly. That'd be my guess. Um, because it's a pretty clean lap, and, uh, it ends up being a 15.6, which is just flying. Uh, it would have been the fastest lap in the lobby by eight tenths, and there were some real heavyweights in this lobby, so I was kind of freaking out when I saw how fast I went. And if I had gotten that time clean, it would have ranked me about 85 or 90, uh, which is much better. Um, so uh, that's why I wanted to bring it to you guys. I just It was, it was sort of a, a surprise that I was able to use my spot tune to do that well. I wasn't actually intending to use the spot tune. I just didn't get a time to load another one, and it ended up working out well, and that's just sort of the beauty of it. So... Uh, thank you guys so much for checking this out. Um, I've been trying to upload content as much as possible. I've really been trying for every day. I haven't quite made it, but um, I'm uploading a lot of content every week. Uh, so make sure you guys check that out. Uh, lots of videos, almost 20 videos in the last couple weeks. So check those out. There's also plenty of videos on my channel already. Make sure you look at those if you're interested. And if you like my content, subscribe and check back soon. So I can bring you more stuff and you won't miss any of the stuff that I upload. Thank you so much, guys. I really appreciate you taking the time to check this out. I'll see you next time.